it's a final year engineering project prototype it's a multi-source priority based load switching this project is based on multi-source detection system so this is for the solar and this one is for the wind and this one is for the utility company this relay board uh, is used for the sensing that currently which source is available and we have relay boards each one is four channels consisting of the four relays and I have also already posted some video tutorials on the PCB designing and uh, I have also a tutorial on the relay programming and its connections and uh, how to how to connect these resistors transistors and uh, uh, diode and what's the purpose so I'm um, using all the very basic components this is a DC socket and this one is a diode and this one is a 7812 voltage regulator and a capacitor so similarly this one also consists of the same components and this one also and this one also and you can see this uh, it, uh, it, it is a transformer, 12 volt transformer, step down transformer and here is a rectifier which converts AC into DC and again there is um, a capacitor for the filtering to get the smooth DC. So, so how it works actually, it's, uh, it's, it's work on the priority switching. For example, we have these four sources, one, two, three and this one is four we have set the priorities the the solar system has the highest priority the second priority is the wind the third and this one is the fourth so when all these sources are available only the solar will be selected to turn on this node and if uh, only the the wind is selected which has a second priority then this turn this load will turn on even if these two loads sources are available it will only activate this line and the third priority is of the uh, is of the utility company line so this 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 has a third priority so if this source is available and this is also available so it will go for this one and if and this source will be selected only if all the uh, other three sources are not present so currently uh, we didn't uh, we didn't connect the Arduino you know and let's run this project and see how it works. I'm connecting the Arduino Uno. It's now on. And this is the uh, pin which is directly coming from the solar panel. So, so currently we have five, one, two three four and five so this one will be used for for the relay boards and you can see now these are turned on and now let's run the computer the terminal screen and we'll see as you can see that currently no source available and you can see the light is also off so let me activate the the solar the solar line which is this one directly coming from the solar and now you can see the load is on and on the computer only solar is available and let's also connect the wind you can see now what it's saying it's saying that solar and wind are available but currently solar is selected so as the solar has the the highest priority so if I remove this one the wind will only be activated so you can see as that's crazy now you can see only wind source is available so let me connect the solar and pull switch back now again it's switched so let me also connect all these sources transformer so be careful when, when you're working on such type of project so now it's 
you can see it's working now okay but is so no matter if I remove or connect because the solar line is already activated so it won't affect if I connect the solar because that's already high and now if for example for if for example the solar line is not available maybe it's nighttime or there are clouds and it's not so when I remove that now what it will say it's saying that wind, Bogda and battery are available. So these three sources are available and currently wind is leaking. So that's the supply coming from the wind. So so if I remove these two sources, nothing will happen because it's already set. So now let me remove the the wind. So it will shift to the Wabda line. Now it's just reset itself and now you can see that it's saying that the Wabda and the battery are available but currently Wabda is selected so even if I remove the battery line so the battery will be used only uh, has the last priority so let me remove this one and you can see it just reset also so and now you, you can see the shifting during this time the wind becomes available so it will shift itself to the wind you can see now and also now the solar is available now it's shifted to a solar. So that's how this world project works. It's a it's a multi-source priority based load switching. And this is a 12 volt DC bulb. And these are the wires coming from these relays. Even we can uh, use this for the inverter if we connect an inverter at at the output of these two wires then we can control the AC loads as well if you need the project code in the schematics leave a comment and uh, I will send you the code so thanks for watching